Babes, it's Mark and as you can see from the title, I'm on holiday and I wanted to get everything out of the way and now we're in Mallorca and I'm with Sabrina and this is our first holiday together and I'm so excited, we actually just got to the hotel. It is midnight, so we're probably going to go out and grab something to eat and Hello. Say hi guys. Hi. I'm just scrolling on Instagram. Yeah. Do you? Do you like the hotel, babe? Oh, I love it. It's so nice, guys. Like, honestly, it's got this kind of beachy vibe to it, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's like, it's as if we're in a boat or something. Yeah, like, it's no. proper wooden and Yeah, proper. Just, even look at this. Like, this Literally, thing. the hotel is really nice. I really yes. like it. I really like it. It looks like pristine. So I'll show you that now. So this is the bathroom. It's like an open bathroom. This is the toilet. And then we've got the shower. And then we've got some storage, and then here is the room. It's really big. It's really spacious, I think. And then outside on the balcony, we've got a little terrace. And then here's the pool. It's a really lengthy pool, isn't it? And then we've got those two pools as well. Um, but yeah, we'll see what we get on after I freshen up. So guys, we left the hotel and we were looking for food and we thought that we were gonna have to end up in Magalhaes to actually get food. Yeah. But right outside the doorstep, we found this place called Saffron, I believe. So we got some korma and vegetable pilau rice. Uh, Korma is like my favorite dish. And it actually is very nice. Huh? Is it nice? Is it nice? Yeah. I think yeah. the sauce is good. It's going to be good. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. Um, so we're just going to have this like late midnight meal. So yeah, it's like nearly one o'clock. It's time for dinner. Oh, so sweet. <laughs> um, thank you to Nick, by the way, for this watch. I know you're watching. So thank you so much for this watch. It's very, very special. But yeah, we're just gonna enjoy the food now. Literally all done. We demolished that. We literally basically finished that within 10, 15 minutes. Literally so finished great. it. Down to the tea, all the chicken, all the rice, to the grain. That's how you do it. Good morning, guys. So um, it's the next morning, and we are just get we need to get ready, have breakfast, and what else are we gonna do? We're gonna go. To um, we're gonna go to the beach. Each. Let's go get away. They say what, what they gonna say. I wanna get so brown, and we're gonna do activities later. So. We'll see what we get up to. We're just gonna get ready now. So I can't even see the screen right now, but we're at the beach. <laughs> yeah. We're all creamed up, all natural, and um, this this is the view. So basically, it's just it is um, it's eleven o'clock now, and this is what we're looking at. And we're just gonna be tanning here for time. So it's we're four hours in to like being on the beach and we've gone into the sea and I think I've gone a little bit dark. Do you think you've gone a little bit <laughs> Wait, dark, babe? let's show them your tan line, please. I did not expect this to happen at all, but it's like crazy. Okay, so are you ready? You can ready. already see it a little bit, but like... wow, It's so crazy. That's like, insane. I don't... I've never tanned this like much in such a quick amount of time. I mean, I do tan well, yeah. but like to say that it's a second day that we're in not even and yeah but that I'm gonna is go insane. to the sea now so. <laughs> <laughs> this is the beach and then that's our that's hotel. hotel I really oh. really like it so far I really do recommend so nice. it yeah definitely so far so good definitely so we just got our food yeah we got some paella so it's got chicken and seafood uh, you have to in it. It just has to be done in it. It just has to be done. Really, I have when to you're self control. Yeah, <laughs> it's all right. It's all, it has to be done. But yeah, we're just gonna enjoy this now. Let's see how it is. Yeah, this is good. Mm -hmm. You like it? Mm -hmm. Thank you, baby. You're so um, you gave in halfway in it, and then I had to get, eat the rest of the paella. Yeah, you did good. I did good. I did it like a chunk. And yeah, I didn't want to leave any on the table, but we're in this place called Smoothie, which sells authentic frozen yogurt. And I got this uh, smoothie, just got mango, watermelon slush, and natural yogurt. And, and you got an ice cream in it. <laughs> what is that? Nutella, peanuts, and what? A vanilla, and, and yogurt. Thank you. Mm. Oh, that is so good. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is lovely. Go on, try a bit of that. 
Guys, we just had a nap here and we woke up. <laughs> um, an hour. Yeah. And now it's delayed everything, but we're gonna get ready to go out. We'll film get ready with me. I'm just getting some coffee because I really want some coffee right now. But they only have decaf, which is how annoying is that? I, I really that Well hour. done! <laughs> oh my god, it's so thick in it. You're gonna get bruised. Okay guys, so I have this two-piece on, very summery from Pink Boutique. A little pink crop on the entire, flowy shorts, and then I've got wedge white sandals with it. Sandals look like I wear these all summer round. And yeah, this is my outfit. I have got my Primark nails on. My outfit is an outfit that I got inspiration from Miles J. So I'll leave that down below. My heels are from Miss Selfridge. And my watch is from a subscriber of mine, actually. And this is from Fossil. And my hair is from bestlacewigs.com. I really love this color number. I love a good pattern. Problems, patterns, and color. You know what I mean? So this is my look. Yep, we're ready. We're gonna go out. So it is 4.30 now. I just got home. It was a really good night. Honestly, I'm just gonna go to bed, okay? I'm gonna take this makeup off and then go to bed. Bye. Go Morning, guys. It is 11 o'clock and we are going to have breakfast. How are you feeling, darling? Oh my god. Um, I think my hair is saying exactly how I'm feeling. Yeah. Crazy. You hit your hair twice on that concrete. Can you hear that? Concrete lamp. So it really it's, hurt, guys. Yeah. Like, it hit me here on my temple yesterday. Well, I was getting ready last night. And as I've got this morning, I've smacked it right on here. We'll take you downstairs. So we just finished breakfast. Honestly, this place is just incredible. I just find it so incredible. The outside bar, and then that is like this freaking lemon tree. And then, um... That goes up to the pool, and then this is a hotel lobby. Above it is the pool as well. In front of the hotel is literally the beach. So everything is so easy access here. If I ever forget anything in the hotel, it's literally across the street. So how incredible is that? I'm literally loving this place so much. I'm not hungover, I just had a really big breakfast. I had my plate, the rest of Sabrina's plate. I also had a plate of pancakes and croissants and also churros, obviously. Orange juice, a celery smoothie, which was disgusting. I had coffee as well. So I'm just trying to like eat a lot and I'm just trying to bulk up. So guys, we are at the pool area. Oh my gosh. I am Beth. Footed right now. Shit, shit, I can't be on this wood. I can't be on this wood. I can't be on this wood. <sighs> Alright, okay. Fam, that wood is so hot. So we are here at the pool area. So there's two pools here and there's another pool over there. But we're just kind of laying out in the sun. We've been here for about an hour and a half now. And um, outlooking us is also the beach right over there. So today we decided to have a pool day. We'll probably go to the beach later on and we're gonna go jet skiing. We're both wearing a red number. I'm wearing my... Yeah, we're matching, matching, matching. Yours is from Primark, mine's from Primark. The, the sun is actually burning. It's like, I'm loving it. Um, so we're just gonna stay here for a couple more hours and see what's going on. And here we have a mark. <laughs> <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> so me and Sabrina are in this place called I don't even know what it's called, no, sis. Oh, there's a thing. It's Matt's. called Matt's Garden Restaurant. Yes. And what are you having, B? Um, I'm having wok vegetables and basmati rice. Oh my god, this looks incredible. And I'm having oh, brother, I want to do that. Um, I'm having like a hummus platter, just something little before we go jet skiing. We've just finished our little meal. To be honest, mine was a bit more of a... It was a snack. Yeah, mine was a snack, but your rice was really nice. Wasn't it yummy? It was so nice. And um, we're going to find Palmanova Beach, yeah. where they should hopefully have jet skis or water sports or something. 
It is actually quite late, babes. If you think about it, I hope it's still open. Imagine we've gone all this far and it's not open. Oh my god, it's so funny, right, guys? Did we tell them about the receptionist? I'm thinking oh. we were a couple. <laughs> oh. Yeah. We go on, go on, go on. So when we first arrived, um, the guy on reception was like, oh, yeah, this is very nice. We have a nice area for, you know, you couples. And then we was like, oh, no, 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 we're not a couple. He's like, no. Was that, brother no. and sister. Yeah, he's yeah. Like, brother and sister. He's like, no. He's actually changing it all. Anyways, um, so but then we was like, no, no, we're just friends. And he didn't really, like, he was confused, like, just friends. Absolutely. And then, last night. Yes. Mark comes down. Full beat. Glam, heels, like, wig, tuck. Everything. To the heavens. And then he was like, oh my gosh, like, wow. And I was like, yes, yeah, see, friends. Uh-huh. Oh. The one who recommended Cheetos to us. Absolutely. And to be fair, I actually really enjoyed that place because, like, the Latino music was good. And you have to experience the Latin music. Mm. I really enjoyed the Latino music and <laughs> <laughs> that's of which we don't speak of <laughs> um, it was nice it was nice there was like performers there and stuff there were people in drag there was actually like gay people and like trans people as well which um you know i appreciate that you know obviously for sure i think people here are really open-minded and it's not even a fact of being like actively um, open-minded about it I just don't think they care no I think it's literally just like normal they just see it for what it is yeah. which is what it should be really in an ideal world uh, we've not got far to go so we will see here we go everything up is for a reason in it we've got this uh, we've got this uh, slide boat thing and uh, yo here we go my legs are so <laughs> so we are on this boat we're driving it yeah, we're gonna go into the sea. I'm gonna slide through here and go on the water. Yes, I'm excited, sis! It's time for dinner! Hey guys, so I'm just about to jump into the water. Water. Slide into the water with the slide. So here we go, sis. <laughs> You're actually hilarious. <laughs> Imagine if I drowned. No, it's fine. The lifeguard, I think, is watching us because we told him I can't swim very well. So, guys, we are now... Wait, I don't even know the last vlogging clip that you saw. It was probably when we were on the paddle boat. But... <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, we ate. We took loads of pictures. And honestly, it's just been so manic today, guys. Um, but we managed to get ready. And we're actually going to go to Magaluf today. Yesterday, we stayed in Palma. Mm -hmm. Palma Nova, we went to Tito's, and tonight is the night of Magaluf, which is um, set to be interesting. I am excited. I'm actually really, really excited because I'm like, if we're going to go here, we should go. Do you know what I mean? And last night we did the Latin music. I was like, we need to do this. Today, we need to go to Magaluf. So today, I am wearing this bobby pins hair, which I'm feeling very Aquaria with this hair, to be honest. I'm wearing my Primark earrings and then I'm wearing this from Pretty Little Thing which is a tie-up top and Primark Primark shoes are from simmyshoes.com <laughs> Oh my gosh, my makeup looks sickening This Does this have like a smoothing filter on it? I don't know Because this is making us look so much more smoother on your camera. So a promoter was hustling us and it was like 35 euros for six clubs, one strip club and then unlimited drinks. Was it a strip club? Yeah, 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 a strip club, yeah. Oh my god, it was. I did oh Yeah. And I didn't know. But the bad part of it is it wasn't good at all. So Magaluf was just basically a place full of young people a lot of them were underaged and it made me feel really uncomfortable there was just like drinks everywhere yeah. broken glass everywhere and uh, people were really disrespectful to each other though 100% like, they're so abrupt and too much you know when it's like there's yeah, just for no sure. mutual respect here people sure. are just like messy 100% like it's literally a place where people go and um, get messed up in yeah. the head in terms of like drinking so much alcohol and like 
getting taking someone home for the night mm -hmm. or a few people or a group um which is if that is what you want then you can do what you want but that was not what we wanted no and we want i would to just dance and yeah hundred percent you know enjoy going out i think that's why a lot of people like to go out is because they like to enjoy dancing having fun absolutely and with their honestly from my perspective to you guys as my audience i wouldn't recommend for you guys to go at all i don't know just i wouldn't go back not. again you know no no Mallorca, amazing mm -hmm. okay. absolutely go and go to the clubs in Mallorca. but my galuf is just a no it's just a no it's not a bit of us we had decided to go home at this point and mm. a hustler was chatting to us asking it's us where we were from friendly. absolutely and then as we were leaving to go back home uh he started to chat to Sabrina in a really disrespectful way. Um, sorry guys, yeah, I was just eating a nutty bar, which now you're not eating. It's so nice, isn't it? Mm hmm So, yeah, no, um, a lot of these hustlers that approach you, a lot of them are quite, like, hey, 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 straight away, whereas a few of them were really nice and polite and stuff, mm -hmm. and, um, he was like, oh, girls, is that where you from? Where are you going? Blah, blah. He was like, no way, I'm from this area. And I was like, okay, cool. And then he's like, so where are you girls going now? And I said, well, we're going back home. to our hotel. Yeah, mm -hmm. we're going home. He's like, hi, Mo, well, can I join you? So he's like, no. no. And then he went, oh, why? I said, uh, because I have a boyfriend. And he, was, he grabbed the back, so basically, he grabbed the back of my neck as we was walking. And he was like, oh, it's Magaluf, forget about your boyfriend or long your boyfriend off or whatever. I can't remember that word for word, but it was like, forget about your boyfriend. And I was like, no, I can't do that. Like, I'd never do that to my boyfriend. And then, um, so as he, because as he grabbed the back, and I was like, no, I'd never do that to my boyfriend. I went like this with my shoulder, and then me and Mark just started walking. And as he was walking, he kind of just popped his head, like, walking, he went, oh, well, I've got an 18-inch dick. Ah. Uh... Well done, I mate. still can't get over it. To well be honest. done, mate. And I was just like, mm, "Good for you." Do you really think that a girl would then turn around and say, "Go on, then. I'm gonna go home with you." After saying that, you, you just like sold. <laughs> literally. Do you know what though? It does. Not that bad. Can you imagine? Like, isn't it? But it does baffle me the way some people actually think. That Don't get me wrong. Literally, like, I'm sure there are different cases in that way and I'm sure maybe there are people there are good people who go to my or whatever yeah, yeah of course um but the people that we experienced tonight um wasn't that great yeah as we was walking by Mark was walking in front of me and I was a bit behind and then um he was like oh that's such a fake ass yeah because obviously I had friends. my uh, obviously because I had hip like pads. my hip pads and everything and yeah. I wanted to give Wulmana and exactly. um and then because he said that i heard it and i wasn't going to be like what are you saying so um i was like are you waiting for a cab just to be like shady hello like mm -hmm. yeah sorry you talk about my friend do you want to repeat that um and he was like cab because obviously i guess it might be like a london thing he's like no the taxi rank is there and i was just i was like cool i thought don't because people like that really annoy me and as i said in my vlog it's people like that who stop people from expressing how they want to be dressing how they want doing things that they want to do because of judgment from other people like that so what if you've got hip pads on so what if you've got that on you know what people make choices and that was a choice from us but people in magaluf that was also a choice made by them so they can stick by that, and we will stick by ours. We're going to get up early and have such a good day, and we're going to feel good getting up. Absolutely. Good night. It is uh, the next morning, and I am just getting ready with Sabrina. And we are going to this kind of island thing. I don't know what it's called. I can't remember. It's on my phone. But um, we're going with... Basically, it was weird enough, but the second night we were here, when we went out on a night out I saw my course mate here and it was so bizarre it was absolutely 
like it was really bizarre um small world um and he lives really close to me as well he lives literally like three minutes walk from my house did you know that's a really like he lives three minutes walk from my house the area is not quite that big though. it's really small it's really small yeah. um so we're going over there i'm gonna grab some breakfast actually before we leave so yeah, that's what i'm thinking as well because i believe it's a bit rumbling you know yeah so um let's bring some water as well we're in color this morrow Colour yeah, colour this we were gonna take loads of like pictures and stuff like that. We have done, but we can't do changes and everything just because um, my dog was popping off and um, it's really hot and we just kind of want to enjoy the day to be honest at this point. It's too hot. Yeah, it's too hot and it's really, really busy where we are right now. Um, and you know what? Let's just enjoy our fourth day here. So we're just going to go into the sea. It's beautiful here. It's so beautiful. There's a lot of people, but like on the cliff side, there's caves. We can swim there. It's really, really nice. And we want to get darker for sure. Zoom in as much as I can right now and show you Mark. So Mark is in the pink shorts right here. Guys, they're looking to jump off of this. Aren't they men all? <laughs> yeah, I'm now scared? fucking. Was I scared? A little bit. So I had just cliff jumped for the first time. Mm -hmm. It was so good. It was so worth it. Yeah, no, Did it look scary? Crazy. Yeah, I would crap my pants if I had to do anything like that. Oh my gosh, it was so much fun. I love a bit of adrenaline. No, you and I definitely, definitely would do it again. I think we're going to do it in the next 10 Yay, minutes. Wow. Literally, literally, it's so good. You guys are brave. Yeah. Um, I'm happy that I've done it, for sure. So we are back in the car now and after I dived into the sea, after I cliff jumped, I actually just, um, we rested, went back into the sea, and then I had, uh, I just sunbathed for the rest of the day. And now we're going to see if we have enough energy to go to a cathedral uh, near Parma. Go team, go! We've only got the parking space for half an hour, we're gonna go to the cathedral. Day. If we can find it quickly, hey, my little senorita. Wow, this is beautiful. So, guys, we went to the cathedral and we all done everything, took photos, booked there, found it within the space of 30 minutes. And now we're gonna head back to the hotel. And shower. Shower I've because got the Sabrina. Hair, dry skin. Dry lips. Dry these lips, let me tell you, these lips are on the, the desert, level. Sahara Desert. The, the Sahara Desert people. Can I just say, guys, I'm so proud of myself for cliff jumping. You know, there's an adrenaline rush when it comes to when you're standing right off a cliff. But I'm well proud of myself for doing that and I love a good adrenaline rush for sure. Um, I love rides, I love doing new stuff like that. So I can't wait to do more of those sort of things in the future for sure. Actually just past nine and um, we're at dinner. And we've said bye to Abdul Rahman and Amir. And um, we had such a lovely time with them. I just want... I'm just so grateful that we got to spend some time with them and um, I just want to thank them for inviting us and we had such a lovely day, honestly. I got black bean rice, chili con carne, um, chips, uh, potatoes, chicken and what do you have sis? Chips, sweet corn and a fajita style thing and a lemon. Ooh, bit of salt, bit of salt. A lot of salt. A lot of salt, sis. It is quarter past one, and we have got to be up in like three, four hours. 
for our flight at seven, but I've just packed, more packed, all good, and um, Sabrina's all packed as well. So we literally just need to wake up, get dressed, and that's pretty much it. And the hotel's pretty clean as well, and I love staying here. I think it was a really, really good hotel, and I, it's not even just the room in itself. I thought the people, the customer service was great. I love a good customer service. Absolutely, would love a bit of that. So I'll leave a link to the actual hotel down below because I actually really did enjoy it. If you're planning to go to Mallorca, which I think you should as well because I've had a lovely time. This area is so nice. <clears throat> I'm just going to put a face mask on and call it a day. And you'll have to wake up really, really early. Getting ready, mate. We're going to get the coach from the hotel to the airport. Yeah, we could. No, it is actually freezing. <sighs> Off like in a few hours. So, um, I'm just gonna get myself cleaned off, get ready and then go. Guys, we're outside the beach. Well, outside the hotel as well. It's really it's dark. dark. Um, so dark. By this time in England, it's starting to get light. But England's just different, isn't it? It's true. And um, we're just gonna get waiting for the coach now. Everything's on time. Everything is set and hopefully it's a smooth travel. It will be. Yeah. Definitely. Just want a wall out when we get there, to be honest. So guys, we are in the plane now. Sorry for like the gaps in between, but um, we just wanted to get everything sorted out at the airport because um, things happen. Yo sis. We're back in England. Um, so I'm just waiting for Sabrina now. We're just going through customs and then we're gonna get baggage reclaim and then we're gonna pop up and um, my holiday is finished. I'm so sad. And this is where we park. <laughs> Sis, we look so good. No, we don't. We look tan. How you guys have enjoyed our video? I hope you liked it. We had the best holiday ever. We did. It was so good. <laughs> Bye. Bye, guys.